Yo, what's going on YouTube fam? Jeff Fallout here back at it again with another video. And for today's video, we're gonna be talking about Henley shirts and why you guys should be incorporating these shirts into your wardrobe. And trust me, these shirts will take your style to the next level, like movie star, action hero, next level, okay? So definitely stay tuned. All right, Henleys. So super clean, classic shirts that have been around for a while. Yeah, a long while. But they made a super strong comeback in the recent years. And I gotta say, they've become like one of my favorite shirts to wear whenever I go out anywhere. All right, so Henleys typically don't have a collar. They do have these buttons that run down to about the midline of the chest and sometimes down to the abdomen. And they'll have like a variety of different number of buttons. This one I'm wearing right now is from H&M. It has four buttons going down the middle but there are other ones that have more buttons or less buttons, depending on which style you get. They also come in a variety of sleeve lengths, like this one, which is a long sleeve, but you know, I got it cuffed up to keep that masculine look, y'all. Yeah. And they also come in short sleeve for those of you out there that like the short sleeve look. Henleys are also constructed in a variety of materials as well. Like this one, for example, is a pretty thin uh, Henley that I wear usually around in the summer months uh, when it's a little warmer outside. So it helps me stay cool. But in the colder months, you can get a heavier cotton blend or wool blend with like a thermal design, which helps you keep warm in the colder months. And they also look great with a blazer or jacket for those of you that like to layer up in the colder months. So now the prices of Henleys can vary greatly also. If you guys look online, you can see Henleys that could go for $100 plus. But uh, if you do some digging, you can find some cheaper ones out there like uh, this one from H&M, which was around 20, 25 bucks or something like that. So you guys do have some options out there as far as your choice of which Henleys to get. I mean, this one I've had for a few months now and I've washed it countless times and it's still holding up pretty nicely. So if you're thinking about getting a Henley from H&M, I definitely recommend it. But if you guys wanna try out some of the more expensive brands out there, go for it. So I decided to make this video after I started noticing a trend in a lot of the action movies that I've been watching recently. And I'll let you guys guess what that trend is. Yep, you guessed it. All the main characters are wearing Henley shirts. And yeah, they look pretty badass. I'm not even gonna lie. Yeah, Henleys, that's where it's at. I mean, these shirts just look good. They have that super masculine, sexy aesthetic and yeah. They just look good. You'll see movie stars like Idris Elba, Brad Pitt, Dylan O'Brien, Chris Pratt rocking Henleys all the time in their movies. And yeah, they look like they're about to go fuck some shit up, but they're gonna look good doing it. So yeah, that's one style hack for all you guys out there that are trying to get that movie star action hero aesthetic or look. All you gotta do, rock the Henley. Now, for maximum Henley effect, you're gonna wanna get something that's a little more skin tight, like this, for example. Perfect. Now that's about as tight as you want it to fit on your body. You don't want it to be any tighter than that or else you'll end up looking like a douche. But you know, if that's the look you're going for, do you fam. Now you don't want the Henley shirt to be too big or too loose either because that that just won't look good at all. I mean, you look like the shirt just swallowed you up honestly and who wants that? So yeah, fit is definitely important when you're deciding on which Henley to get. Yeah guys, it also helps to be uh, on the muscular side if you're gonna wear these shirts. Just like with any other shirts, yeah. It looks a lot better when you work out. But you can rock them if you're skinny or on the bigger side also. And yeah, that's it for this video, guys. If you found this video helpful, definitely hit the subscribe button down below and the little notification button next to it for future updates on video uploads. And uh, yeah, I'll catch you guys on the next video. Peace.